Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. So today we've got another unboxing video for you. Now this is part of my new series, it's called the Alternative Investment Series. And basically what I've been doing is I've been returning to my childhood and I've been buying toys mainly from the 90s such as Pokemon cards, Matchbox toys, Pogs, Go-Go's, Mighty Max, all those sort of toys that if you were born around the same time as me you would have ended up playing with when you were younger. And I've basically been buying them from eBay, unboxing them on this channel. Then I'm, the plan is to repackage them, put them into storage for around five to ten years. Then we'll get them back out, we'll unbox them again, and we'll see whether they've gone up in value, down in value, or stayed the same. So it's kind of a bit of fun, a bit of an experiment, and hopefully we'll make some money as well along the way. So in today's video, we've got one here. I've already started unboxing it here because it was, it was wrapped up quite tight with tape. I've already cut off some of the tape. This arrived today. Really nicely packaged, actually. So there should be three items in here in total. Yep, I've got the paperwork there. Let me just remind myself how much these cost. Okay, so these cost £7.50 in total, including delivery. Now, these are Corgi cars. Well, they're not actual, actually cars, they're vans. So, the reason I've gone for these is they're advertisement vans. So, that one's McVitie, biscuits one. Now, the case is that the boxes are a bit tattered on them, as you can see. But, when you get things like this, it's very, very hard to get them in pristine condition unless you're looking to pay a lot of money. Like I said, I paid £7.50 in total for these. So you do have to expect to pay a lot more if you want to get things like this in really good condition. So this is a Kellogg's Corn Flakes one. And like I said, they're all advertisement ones. And the reason I've done that is because you're not only getting the collectible car, you're also getting the the, the advertisement side of things so you'll appeal to more people so for example this one would appeal to people that collect these vintage these vintage sort of uh, models and also it would appeal to people that collect Cadbury's things same with Kellogg's and the same with McVitie's so that's why I've gone for these three because there's more of a, a market for them when I come to sell them in the future now let's try and find the the year on these, oh there we go, 1993. So it's talking around about 20 years old, so like I said, unless you're willing to pay big, big money, you're not gonna get things like this in immaculate condition boxes. But I'm really, really pleased with them. Like I said, 750 for all three, and that was including delivery, so I think that's a bargain. Now, I'm gonna package them all back up. I'll probably use the same box. Put them in there, like I said, return to them in five years' time and we'll see whether they've gone up in value, down in value, or stayed the same. So yeah, let me know what you think of this investment. Let me know if you think I will make some money on it or whether I'll lose money on these. Thanks very much for watching, as always, and I will see you in the next video.